fascinating team. I just want to say I miss you. I hope you're feeling well and doing well. We're all getting through this together, but we're going to have a little fun today because we get to make some hand mashed banana pudding from your living room. We'll be using one of my favorite fruits, bananas. Quick fun fact, a bunch of bananas is actually called a hand. And a single banana is called a finger. Are bananas good for you? Heck yeah. Why are they good for you? Who can think of a reason? Vitamins? Absolutely. Potassium? Terrific. Also, it's said that bananas put you in a very good mood. So, eat your bananas. We are going to make hand mashed banana pudding. That's right, hand mashed. No tools required. But the first thing we need to do, tell me or tell your staff, what should we do first before we start preparing any food? Wash our hands. So take a break for one second, wash your hands, look at the screen and see what ingredients you will need to make the banana pudding. I'll see you in a minute. Okay, welcome back everybody. Let's see, did you get your ingredients together? If you are working in your living room, please remember to keep everything on a plate or on top of some sort of vessel where we're not spread out and we don't have any messes today, okay? Hey guys, first thing we need to do, put your gloves on. So everybody take a minute, make sure you have your gloves on so we don't get banana fingers and we don't make a mess and we don't contaminate anything. So I'm going to use my first Ziploc bag, it's open, to put my banana and my yogurt in. But fun fact I wanted to share, did you know that technically bananas are not grown on a tree? It's actually called an herb. And they are a berry, a relative to a berry, also, I don't know how this works, but these are called hands. And a single banana is a finger. So, we're going to take our finger banana and put it in the Ziploc bag. If you need someone to help you as staff or work together, if there's a group of you, to peel your banana. Put my peel over here. That's going in the garden to help our plants grow. Banana bag, perfect. Now we're going to take our heaping spoonful of yogurt. I'm using Oika's vanilla flavored, but you can use any yogurt in your refrigerator, we'll be fine. In you go. Now, the fun part is hand mashing. So we're going to zip our Ziploc, Take one hand, two hands, and start to mash our yogurt and our banana together. If for some reason your banana is not quite ripe enough, you can let it sit on the counter for a little bit and come back to it. As you can see, mine was ready to be mashed. Now, I'm going to set my hand mashed yogurt and banana to the side while I prepare my topping. I'm grabbing my second Ziploc and you have a choice. I know a lot of you have the Velveeta cookies in your house or you may have some vanilla wafers. If you do not have either of those available, you can actually use some dry cereal. Today we're going to use the Velveeta wafer cookie. I prefer just one is enough. We don't want to have too much sugar in our snack. Put it in the Ziploc, seal your Ziploc, and again, you get to mash it up with your hands. <clears throat> when you are preparing this, you can set it aside for snack time, or it can stay in the Ziploc in the refrigerator for tomorrow or the next day. Okay, so we have our hand mashed 
banana pudding, and our topping for when we're ready. Okay guys, who's ready to try their hand mashed banana pudding? I know I am. So I've gone to the refrigerator, I got my bag of mashed banana and Greek yogurt, and my dry topping. Now the fun part is you can actually eat this with a spoon out of the bag. But first, I want to add my dry ingredients. If I added them too soon, what would happen? They would get soggy. Good answer. Very good. Okay. Sprinkle some on top. Grab a spoon and enjoy. I hope to see you guys soon. In the meantime, keep those hands clean, be safe, and I look forward to you telling me what you thought of the first video. And there'll be more. So see you soon. Bye everybody. doing buddy it's me I'll see you soon okay bye and are ready to get some cooking done I don't like that either we're gonna have to do it again one more time. I think that was good brought to you in your home I don't like that no it's good okay you having a conversation so today hand mashed banana pudding that's right hand mashed no wash our hands yeah. and pudding. I'll see you in a minute. If you need some help, don't, 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 don't. <laughs> you have a banana, I'm done. Five, you're supposed to be wearing your mask. <laughs> Terrific. So <laughs> right. any yogurt you have in the house will be, no idea, suitable. You're gonna have to. All right, welcome back guys. Let's go ahead and get our, oh no, it was welcome back, not, we already did welcome back. We are social distancing. However, if you are going out, you know you're supposed to, you know you're supposed to. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> you're safe. You've been just, I can't do this. <laughs> Greek yogurt. If you have plain yogurt, vanilla yogurt, try to keep all of your things. Stop! <laughs> <laughs>